State police and deputies in the multiple parishes are trying to find a man they call armed and dangerous. And we're learning a state trooper has been found dead about a mile from one of the shooting scenes. We'll get to that in just a moment, but first we want to go over the details of the deadly shooting spree in the Baton Rouge area. So what you see right now, this is the suspect according to law enforcement, 31 year old Matthew Meyer. Now Meyer is accused of shooting a two people in Livingston Parish around midnight. Both victims survived in that shooting though. Now the Livingston Parish Sheriff says he believes Meyer was familiar with the victims and these were not random shootings. About three hours later, a man and a woman were shot in Ascension Parish. The woman passed away and the man is in critical condition. At around five this morning in East Baton Rouge Parish, a trooper tried to stop Meyer in a blue Silverado they said he had stolen. There was a shootout between Meyer and the trooper and a bullet hit the trooper's cruiser. State police say that trooper was taken to the hospital to be checked out, but he appears to be okay. Meyer crashed the truck and got away. So here's another look at the suspect. Ladies and gentlemen, he was reportedly wearing a camel clothing. If you see him, call 911 immediately. Now, in what may be a separate incident, a state police trooper was found dead about a mile from the scene of last night's shooting in Prairieville. The name of the trooper has not yet been released, and there's also a large police presence there tonight. Our partners at WBRZ and Baton Rouge report it could be tied to an earlier manhunt, but tonight we're still trying to confirm those details.